Alright everybody, oh happy day. I hope you're doing marvelously well today. In this video, I'm going to share with you some things about habits. We're going to talk about bad habits. We're going to talk about some good habits. We're going to talk about what takes place when we have bad habits and maybe some systems to help you overcome them. But before we get going, JasonFinalExpense.com, I run a national agency and I'm so blessed to partner with some of the most amazing people on this planet if you need help, reach out. But bad habits are something that will really bum you out. It'll mess with your mind, which then messes with your mouth. I'm telling you, if you're in sales, whether it's any kind of sales or any form of insurance sales for that matter, bad habits will really hurt you. They're going to bum you out and they're going to make you broke, okay? If not, it's going to take your income and go wham. Bad habits will bum you out mentally, okay? Because you know you should have done something, but you didn't do it, okay? Bad habits, not good. You need to be really cognizant of the bad habits that you have. That's why having a team around you is so vital, okay? A team around you will help you, okay, break those bad habits quickly because you've got some transparency. The loneliest number in the insurance industry, everybody, is one. Because guess what? If nobody's looking at what you're doing, you can get away with murder, okay? You can get away with all kinds of crazy things in the insurance world. So your bad habits start having what is called a compound effect, it costs you a lot of money when you've got compound effect problems from your bad habits. If you took a piece of like dental floss and you wrapped it around my wrist, like a one bad habit, as long as I catch it quickly, break, I got nothing. That bad habit won't hold me down. It wasn't anything to me, right? So bad habits are like a little string around your wrist. If you catch it quickly, it will not hold you down at all. That bad habit can be easily broken. When you are an insurance agent and you've got this compound effect of bad habits, bad habits again, bad habits again, bad habits again, it's going to take a team to help you sometimes break those bad habits because it put you into a position of bondage, okay? You're bummed out because you know you should have done something different, but you didn't do it. So now you're not making the income and it's got this really bad vortex effect, not good, not great. So the biggest thing that I'll share with you when you start realizing you've got bad habits, get a good buddy system, get somebody around you quickly so that you can break those bad habits or maybe you need somebody to help mentor you and guide you so that you can, okay, maybe have somebody help you cut you free, okay? When you free yourself from the bad habits, you're going to realize you need to replace those bad habits with good things. Your perception okay, of your bad habits is not reality. Right now, you're looking through a kaleidoscope and you don't quite see the big picture, which is why you're allowing sometimes these bad habits to tie you down. So when you're having bad habits, make sure you're keeping your eye focused on where you're going. Don't have this like look in the rear view mirror feeling and that's just getting bummed out all day long, feeling bad for yourself because who knows what. You got to just change your mind, okay? You got to have somebody that comes and mentors you that's going to help you. The perception that you have is not reality. You got to do things, okay? You got to have high action. High action will help you get through this funk, okay? When you've got bad habits, it's just a temporary funk if you break and snap out of it quickly. If you have that compound effect, like I said, it can really harm you in this space. So make sure you've got a good buddy around you, but your perception is not reality. That's why it's so important to be part of a team, to be part of something greater than you. You need people that are stronger than you that can break you free of maybe some poor habits that you've always had. Maybe you need to be more organized. Maybe you need to be more driven. Maybe you need to keep your goals in front of you. You need to be writing down your goals. Write down your goals in the morning. Write down your goals at night. Get a notepad and go at it, okay? Keep your eye on the prize. It's crazy important. This business is not just a business. It's a career. It's a calling. But this business is all about choices, all about choices, all about choices. It's not about your feelings, okay? Feelings are going to leave you broke. It's not just your feelings. You got to control that, okay? High action, high action, high action. 
you got to watch how you have a reaction because sometimes you have high action. You have one negative Nelly on that phone or face to face and it like whoosh, takes the wind out of your sails, right? No, no, no. There's no reaction. There's no retreat. High action, high action, high action. Get on it. Be dialing, smiling, doing what you need to do. If you're a face to face insurance agent, book your appointments, get in the homes, sit down with these great people, bring value to them and sell them the product that they truly need. Bring the solution to the table, but don't react to negativity. You need to be in control. This is all about execution, okay? Bad habits can be overcome by execution. You've got to be intentional, okay? I'm not going to let that string hold me down. Nope, not going to happen. No thanks, okay? I got a buddy that's going to help me. We're on the same page. We're both going this way. Let's go, okay? Having a good buddy system will help you. Being a solo sport player is not going to be great for you. I'm not saying that you're not an individual solo sport agent as an independent agent because you are, but you've got to be driven. You've got to be focused, okay, and have good people around you. I've got tons of good people around me. It's all about the team, okay? You know what they say, okay? The dream work is the teamwork. Have a good team of people that know how to get it done, okay, so that your eye is on the prize, Write down your goals. Get after it. Have somebody that helps you. When you feel bummed out, get a buddy that's going to help pull you up, lift you up, okay? When you temporarily maybe fell down, quit licking your wounds. High action. No longer will you let the reaction of this business impact you. You're going to have execution. You're going to be executing on your plans, and you're going to do it. If yesterday wasn't as good as you wanted, guess what? A fresh day, a fresh chapter has just been flipped. Go, do, do. High action. Don't be reactive. Be action-oriented. Have yourself now in a place that I will not allow these bad habits to impact me. My eye is on the prize. I am laser-focused on what I need to do. You're going to eliminate things in your life that are holding you back, okay? Sometimes it's not that you don't have the power to move forward, but you tied yourself down. You allow these bad habits to hold you back because you're capable if you would just cut the cord on a couple things. Maybe you got to cut the cord on your Netflix. Maybe you've got to cut the cord on staying up so dang late the night before you go to work. Bad habits will hurt you, and they're not that hard to get rid of. Get rid of certain things that keep you away from attaining your goal. You need to do action, but keep okay those things at bay. Those little demons, those little time suckers okay, that are coming after you when you've got bad habits. Everybody's got the same 24 hours in their day. How do you control time? How do you control everything about your business? This is a business. Run it like one. You'll be more productive and more profitable as a result. I hope this helps you. I hope this makes your bad habits at least get reduced Focus on the right things. You're going to feel better, but forget feelings. High action, high execution. Just push, okay? You guys are going to make it. You're going to do phenomenally well. I appreciate you watching. Have an amazing day and be ready. Tomorrow is a coming, and I know you're ready. Have a good one, you guys. Get rested. Here we go.